Good morning, everyone. I'm starting this video on Wednesday. I don't know if that's weird to do, to start like a week in my life on Wednesday, but at this point, anything goes, right? I mean, we're all quarantining inside anyway and trying to stay busy and sane, so I'm just gonna start this on Wednesday and you guys can come along with me. So obviously, I've told you guys, I teach preschool, so every morning at 9.30, I do like a circle time on Zoom with my class. It's 8.45 right now, so I'm gonna change shower get ready for the day actually i don't think i'm gonna shower i showered last night i'm not showering so sue me i'm gonna take you along to what i've actually been doing during the quarantine i usually like if there's like a week in my life video or something i try and like do some more exciting things but there's really nothing to do it's gonna be fun though i can guarantee that it's gonna be a good time so let's go brush our teeth wash our face and get ready for the day So I'm currently trying out some new face stuff for my skincare routine. My skin feels like dull. So I wanted to just switch it up a little bit. I got some new stuff and today is the first time I'm gonna try it out. So um, that's exciting. You can see if it completely fucks up my face. So stay tuned. Okay, this is my beautiful sweat outfit of the day. Do you like it? Yes? No? Okay. I think that was a yes. Okay, into the kitchen we go. So something I've started doing every morning is making Cody and I these like apple cider vinegar drinks in the morning. It's supposed to just be like a detox drink and is supposed to be good for your insides and everything. I'm not really like 100% sure. I just know it's like a good detox kind of thing to have and like we've been eating pretty much healthy but like kind of shitty because all we're doing is sitting around snacking. So it's just nice to have in the morning. You like having the drinks in the morning? Yeah! Okay. Keep this one for myself. <laughs> it's really hot. Cheers. Ow. Yeah, Ow. Here, here, here. I'll cheers for both of us. Thanks. Enjoy. Here. Ow. Hello. Okay, so we just finished circle time. I would say that it was pretty successful. Now I am gonna make some breakfast. So let's let's eat. It's me! Little, very exciting update. I just finished my breakfast, as you saw. Now I'm going to post my recreating TikTok hairstyles video and then do some more stuff online. I'm gonna research a milk frother because I want to get a milk frother to make my matcha lattes in the morning and, um, you know, just some really other important stuff like that. And... That's what I'm doing today. Then I'm gonna film a video making a drinking game that I found on TikTok, like a drinking board game. Cause basically all I've been doing is watching TikTok so I'm just getting all my videos idea, ideas from TikTok. And look who it is. We also just called the vet and we scheduled his appointment to get his balls cut off. Um, but that's happening in like a week. Okay, I'm gonna post the video now. If you haven't watched it already, go watch it after you finish this one. <laughs> Hello! So last time I checked in with you guys, I was going to post my video, which I did, and I was gonna shop for my milk frother and all that stuff online, which I did. I was just like looking at stuff online for a really long time, and then I watched Cody's new podcast with Devin and Sam and watched a little bit of Gossip Girl and just kind of relaxed. I really didn't do much. I know this is not that exciting, but we're all just sitting at home. And I'm just being completely honest with you guys. Like, I, this is just what I'm doing. I'm just chilling, 
trying to get some stuff done. I'm getting a little hungry again, so I'm gonna have some lunch, and I'm very excited because we have some flatbreads from Daily Harvest that I'm gonna make, and Daily Harvest just so happens to be the sponsor of today's video, so let's make our flatbreads. Okay, so Daily Harvest has launched a new collection called Flatbreads. Okay, so I'm gonna make this one, the tomato and cremini one today. Look at these ingredients, made from all vegetables, and there are so many gluten-free and vegetable crusts that have so many more added ingredients, but not Daily Harvest. These are the only ingredients. So once your oven is heated up, you're just gonna put your flatbread into the oven for like 18 to 22 minutes. So as you guys know, I've worked with Daily Harvest before, and when we talked about doing the ad for these flatbreads, I was super excited to try them. And then the whole thing happened with quarantine and everything, and I haven't been able to make it to the grocery store that much, so I've been extra thankful to have these in my freezer. But either way, Daily Harvest and their smoothies have become something I use in or out of quarantine that I love. Look at this beauty. This is absolutely delicious, you guys. So good, so quick and easy, perfect for lunch, perfect for dinner. If you guys wanna get your hands on these flatbreads, click the link in my description and use my code KelseyK for $25 off your first box. Go enjoy Daily Harvest. Now, I'm gonna eat and then film my video. It is 9 p.m. I just finished filming that video, it took forever, but it was worth it because we made a fun game, which at this point you guys should have already seen that video, so you already know that we made a fun game. But yeah, we ate dinner, Cody made chicken and rice, and it was delish. Now we're gonna chill and watch TV, and that is the whole day. Very exciting stuff, and we'll see you tomorrow morning. Night. Hey guys. Happy Thursday. I am wearing the same thing as yesterday, just different pants. I had a really shitty sleep last night and so I like was just tired and I woke up and just kind of like relaxed until I did my circle time because so I was just kind of out of it. And then I made some breakfast and then I just really have been laying around. I've been like, just kind of in like a weird, it's not really like a funk, I think I'm just tired. So because I'm tired, I am making that whipped coffee from TikTok. I made it like this past weekend and I really enjoyed it. It's like a little treat, you know? And I thought I could use a little pick me up. I need some caffeine and this was just what I decided to do. So I'm, I'm currently whipping this up. This whole experience has made me realize that I really need a automatic mixer because it takes way longer with just the power of my hand. But you know, it's like almost, it's like almost makes it taste better because I'm like, wow, my blood, sweat, and tears are in there. So if you don't know what this is, it's two tablespoons instant coffee, two tablespoons sugar, and two tablespoons hot water. And then you just whip it up. You whip it real good until um, it becomes like whipped cream and you're supposed to have stiff peaks, which I don't have yet. Yep, we're good to go. Yes! Oh yeah. It's good. And that concludes this segment on things I'm doing because of TikTok slash more eating and drinking. Check back in with you after my shower and everything. <laughs> Cheers. Hello. How's everyone doing? The last time I talked to you, I was like, oh, I'm gonna shower. I'm so tired today. But now, I finally pepped up after my coffee. Cody and I went outside, we did a little workout. And now we're making some hot dogs and beans for dinner. Pasture raised <laughs> uncured beef hot dogs. Only the best for it's me not and my the, lady. Not the healthiest meal, but so freaking delicious. For What are you making? I'm making us healthy.
fluffy pancakes. I don't know how they're gonna be. Never made them before. So we have oat milk, two eggs, one egg white, Nana. The pancakes are being blended. They're not being blended. They're being cooked. So this one's a little off center because I wanted to try to fit two in this tiny ass skillet for some reason. Don't worry about that. Just gonna do one at a time. Wish me luck. Do you like them? Amazing. They're so good. So fucking They good. really are. It's one of the best pancakes I've ever had. Damn. Can I cop one more? Yeah, duh. All right, there was enough batter to make one mega pancake. The size of the fucking pan. Look at that thing. It's huge. All right, ready? Flip yeah. it. Yes! Woo! Woo! A little segment I like to call Chili Tricks. Ready? Sit. Down. Good down. Sit. Sit. Oh, you good boy. Hello, it's dinner time. I basically just check in just about every time I'm eating. I haven't done much, guys, but now we're eating again, and we're eating some ramen. As we know, I love ramen. I'm sorry, I'm out of breath. I was just dancing <laughs> to um, Paparazzi by Lady Gaga. I don't know, it's, the song's really been hitting different lately for some reason, but I'm making some ramen. Water's boiling, I'll check back in in a second. Hello, happy Saturday. You might notice that Chili looks unbelievably fluffy and clean, and that is because we brushed and bathed him last night, which is a thing we do often, in case anyone thinks differently. Happy Saturday. Did a super shitty job yesterday. I mean, super shitty vlogging-wise. We made some noodles for dinner. Oh, I showed you that. I never showed you the final outcome, but they're pretty good. It took a long time for me to make noodles because I burned the garlic like twice before, so I was just kind of frustrated the whole time, but it's okay because the noodles turned out to be good and we had a nice dinner and we watched Entourage. We started watching Entourage from the beginning, which is always fun. And um, we just relaxed. We bathed chili. You're wondering what that sound is. It's Cody. He's making banana bread. Just whipping up a little family recipe. Whipping up a little family recipe I'm straight out of do, Chrissy Teigen's that. cookbook. I didn't say which family. What else we do? Oh yeah, we baked cookies really randomly last night, like three ingredient peanut butter cookies that were delish. And now we're drinking mimosas because we need to clear some space in our fridge. So we just are drinking the orange juice and the champagne to clear the space in the fridge. We're just doing it for that. We went to the grocery store this morning. Don't think I mentioned that. We went to the grocery store this morning. We wore gloves and masks. There was a good amount of stuff. Not as much as we would have liked, but there was a good amount of stuff and we got some groceries and we're set to cook another week's worth of meals. Okay, cheers, another riveting update. Woo, yeah! Ladies and gentlemen, very good. I'll stay once again. What are you making? Uh, banana bread, French toast. Sunday, you know, might as well um, treat ourselves a little bit. Look at these beauties. <coughs> Holy fucking shit. Is it good? That's insane. That tastes like a restaurant. It tastes like a whole restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> Hello again. Um, I spent pretty much the entire day cleaning and doing laundry, which I actually have to switch out. But now, for Sunday dinner, I am making us the meatloaf that I made at my first ever dinner with Kelsey. I'm really excited, I'm starving, and I hope this doesn't take as long as I think it's going to. Let's get cooking. Finish the meatloaf, well, there's like a little bit less than half, but it was delicious, and to no surprise, I forgot to film, but how did you like it? Fucked up. That's a good thing, right? Yeah, it's completely fucked. It was just fucked. So you liked it? Yeah, it was completely fucked. Chili's asleep. He loves sleeping with blankets in his mouth. Wait, who am I? That guy. Now wait, who am I? Hang on. This is fucked. <laughs> now, what are we gonna do? 
Uh, we're gonna watch Entourage. We're gonna watch Entourage. I just took a shower, washed my hair. I had my circle time earlier. Now I'm gonna edit the board game video and do all that. But first, I know I've been talking to you guys about the stuff I've been using on my skin. And I just have some like redness. And I don't know if it's just because I've been like putting too much on my skin. So I kind of wanted to just do like a face mask and like reset it. I have this. It's like a Indian clay mask and you mix it with apple cider vinegar and you put it all over your skin. So here we go. Okay, I now see why people use brushes to put on masks because that shit got, it's all in my eyebrow. It just didn't go on evenly. I feel a mess. This is not fun. Um, I'm stressed out and I just hope my face does not react poorly to this because it already feels like a bad decision. It's been 10 minutes. I literally, I can't move my face if I wanted to. I fucking hate this. Okay, it's better be worth it. I'm gonna take it off. Thank God, it's so uncomfortable, I can't even talk. It's off, thank God. Right off the bat, my skin definitely feels soft. I'm feeling good, feeling much better than I was feeling when it was on. So far, so good. Dinner time. We are having tuna melts. Tuna melts out of none other then Chrissy Teigen's cookbook. I'm editing. Cody is whipping up the din ski for tonight. And we're just kind of chilling. Uh, melt that motherfucking cheese, boy. We gotta melt that cheese, baby Melt that motherfucking cheese, boy. Melt that motherfucking cheese, boy. All right, bye. Say bye, vlog. Mound that motherfucking cheese, boy. Mound that motherfucking cheese, boy. Gotcha. Okay, say bye. I'm turning it off now. Okay. Later. Amazing grace! <laughs> hey, I haven't gotten dressed today. So we saw this cool trick on TikTok. We're about to try it. You're almost there. It opened it. It is off. Yay! You did it! High five. It's pretty cool.